Mm, what do we have here? Oh, that's lovely. What were you doing hiding in the back of the fridge like that? Now I think I get it. And this whole time, I thought you were just avoiding the dishes. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay, okay, bye. Trudy. Uh, is Raymond here? Mm, not that I can see. Have you checked the trunk? <laughs> Would you like some beer? Sure. I'm guessing Raymond bought this. You've never seemed like a super hoppy kind of gal to me. And you've never seemed like much more than a loggerhead. Yes, Raymond bought it. Yeah, where is he? He's officiating a wedding. A wedding? Whose wedding? Oh, I don't know. Some couple who wanted their ceremony in a brewery. I didn't ask. And it's his second wedding this month. Oh. So, why were you looking for Raymond anyway? Oh, no reason. I wanted to talk to him about my classes. And I was just walking by, and I thought, just walking by through our driveway. Well, <laughs> not exactly. No. Um, Anyway, when did you say Raymond would be back? I didn't. Trudy, why did you stop coming to my yoga classes? Oh, you know, it was just hard to fit into my schedule. Because Raymond said, you said it was because I treated you too harshly? Raymond said that? Yeah, he did. When did he say that? A while ago. What else did Raymond say? Oh, nothing. You know, I just wanted the best from you. I should go. No, stay. Drink Raymond's beer. Tell me more. Would you like some more beer? No, oh, thank you. Suit yourself. Well, maybe a little. Do you think Raymond will be back tomorrow? Maybe. Would you like me to pass on a message? Oh, no, that's okay. Are you sure? There's probably a pen and paper in here somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. That's okay. I should go. Okay, later. You should come back to yoga class. We'll see. Maybe. Maybe Raymond has time. I like your scarf, by the way. I've got one just like it. See ya. Namaste, Raymond. Thank you.